G'day guys, Cam here from thefirstroom.co.nz and welcome to episode 4 of the Nanobyte series that we are doing. Today's topic is, how often should I do water changes? Well, there's no real set in stone answer. Personally, I try and do 50% once a week. The reason I try and do 50% once a week is if I happen to miss one week and I do it the next week, I've done 50% on a fortnight, which is still a lot better than a lot of other people do. The realistic answer is uh, when your nitrates are getting up or if your phosphates are getting up, that's why you're removing the dirty water and putting in fresh water. Um, some people's aquarium take two months for that to happen, other people's aquarium takes three days for that to happen. So there's no real set answer for every individual aquarium. Uh, but if your nitrates are beginning to get up over sort of 60 ppm, I'd be looking at doing a water change. Something else to consider is, uh, we'll use round numbers here if you're taking out you got 100 parts per million nitrate doing a 50% water change you are then down to 50% but you've got sorry 50 ppm so you got 50 parts per million and that's the base level of where your nitrates are going to start and they're going to go up again you take 50% out again you're always constantly going to be at that point so sometimes it's worth doing uh, an extra large water change once a month or if you're in a routine of once a week maybe every fourth week do a 75 or something like that reason behind doing this is that you're going to bring that base level of your nitrates further down a little bit and then you're going to start lower for the upcoming uh, month or what have you. Uh, general guide, if you can keep your nitrates to 20 parts per million, you're doing really well. That is the goal for most uh, fish keepers, particularly here in New Zealand. I don't know if it's different overseas, but most people suggest around 20 parts per million is what you're trying to achieve. Um, obviously having plants in your aquarium, um, can't see it, but up here I've got the trimmer growing out of the water. Uh, if you've got plants with the roots dangling in the water, growing out of the water, that's going to help draw out the nitrates. Um, so there's other things to do it, but I personally think that doing water changes is your best bet. And I like I said, I like to do them once a week at 50% where I can. That just gives me my own personal peace of mind. So there we go. How often would you do water changes? My suggestion is once a week, and I try and do 50%. Doesn't necessarily mean that you have to. All right, guys, have a good one. Happy fish, Kevin. Catch you later.